guys what is up welcome back to my channel it's been a minute since i vlogged but tis the start of vlogmas so welcome back for vlogmas this year i'm gonna be doing like weekly vlogs just because i don't do enough in my day to day where that's going to be exciting at all. So we're gonna be doing weekly vlogs. I just wanted to start today. Um, it is currently Black Friday. Yesterday was Thanksgiving, we had a fab day with family and I had no intention of doing any Black Friday shopping and I kind of didn't even do Black Friday shopping, I just did shopping. And so Evan and I ran out to Home Goods and to Target today and I got a bunch of Christmas decor that I've been wanting to get for a while. So I'm just gonna do a little haul, start it off, get in the Christmas spirit. So let's get into it. I will link everything that I can find for you guys down below. I'm so excited. We did some damage. You can also help me decide what I should be keeping, what I should be bringing back. I kind of just like got stuff because I wasn't quite sure where I wanted things to go. And so we'll figure it out along the way. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, so we're gonna start with home goods. The vibe this year is just like warm and cozy. Like, as you can see, we just have like every shade of brown possible in this room, but it just feels so cozy to me. So I kind of just want to continue that. I'm gonna do like pops of green and red throughout, but just like nothing crazy. Um, I don't even know what I have from last year. So eventually I'll bring that up um, probably at some point this week or weekend. We don't have a tree yet. We're just just doing a couple things to get started. Okay, so last year we got wooden beads um, from Target, but it was like a very short amount and I had to get several of them and we were still only able to put them on the front of the tree. So these, I believe we got like a darker wood and then so I just wanted like a lighter wood to like kind of mix with it. So these are basically the same thing, just not by which Chip and Joey in this brand? Threshold? No. I don't know, you know, hearth, the hearth and hand or whatever. Okay, so we got those to add to what we already have. I got a couple things. My vision for these were like in the kitchen. So I'll bring you guys in there when I put them out to show where they're gonna go. But um, we have like stainless steel, everything in the kitchen. Um, so I just thought these were like cute. I don't know, we'll see. Two hours later. Yeah, it's magnolia. Mm, yeah, is it magnolia something? I've got a bunch of trees. Um, again, not quite sure where they're gonna go. I kind of envisioned this one on like the mantle somewhere because it's like a pretty good height. So we'll see. Um, this one again, I'm thinking maybe kitchen because it's like a white marbly. This one, deaf for the kitchen, because um, we have like the light wood in the kitchen. And then this was for the kitchen as well. It's just like a little soap pump, because it has the stainless steel. I just thought it'd be cute. This one, I think I got for the living room or like our bedroom or something. Again, could be good for the mantle, because it's tall. So, yeah, we'll see where she ends up. I got some towels. Um, that maybe for a gift, so I'm not gonna show you them. And then I got two of the greatest finds I've ever found at TJ Maxx, or it's actually, so it's Home Goods. This Home Goods in particular has the best dog section ever. And I have been looking at this like furry sweater for Pippa online for as long as I've had her now. And it's like $80 and I just cannot cannot justify spending $80 on like a little fuzzy sweater because she's probably just gonna hate it. So I found this one and I was flipping out because they had like every size but her size and I was digging through the racks trying to find her size and they had one and I found it and it needs to be hers. So it's like this little like sweater but then it has fur. Pip, you're gonna look so beautiful. And then I got tea. Yeah, this one's for you, TT. Are you excited? You are? You think we got showed them how excited you are? Tea. This one for you? You're going with Joey and some. I have this one for you. Should we try them on? Let's try them on. Okay. Hold on, Pippi. I'm going to put TT's on first. Come here, sweetie. Come here. You're going so handsome. Come here. 
You are gonna look so handsome, we'll be at some tea. Oh my goodness, T! Oh cool. T, you look so nice. handsome. Cool, tea. Wow! T, that might be my favorite cool. vest I ever got it for you. And Pippi! Cool, oh my goodness, you are gonna be so beautiful! Oh my goodness, Pip! Oh my goodness gracious! Who is the prettiest girl in the whole world? <laughs> Oh my goodness, Pippi! Look at her! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Well, you she looks so uncomfortable. Are so beautiful! Pippi, you look like mommy, baby! <laughs> Would you fuck her? Oh my good! She's like, I'm just worried about the chips that I think Tino's getting without me. You are so beautiful, Pip. She got a turtleneck. <laughs> T, we gotta show them yours. Get a chip and then come with mommy. Oh wow! Oh, look at that handsome boy. You gotta get your eyes wet. You crying because there's chippies. Whoa! Hello, you two look so good. Pip, you look no. so stunning. Wow. Hey, you're cute. Pip, I can't even get over how cute you look. I cannot even <laughs> handle how cute you look. You look so beautiful. We are ripping these tags off. It is not going back. No, it is not. You look so stunning. Oh my goodness. Wow, that was success if I've ever seen it. I think we need to just like really show you how Pippa looks. You are the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my whole life. There we go. Pippi, who is so pretty. <laughs> Pip, that turtleneck is so high. Do we need to double it down? There we go, is that better honey? You look so pretty. I love you so much. You look so beautiful. Hey, stop. Okay, so that I think is all we got from hundreds. Now time for Target. This, got this little wreath um, for our back door. You guys haven't really seen our updated kitchen, I don't think. It's a mess, so I'm not gonna show you right now, but I will show you where this is going. There's a little hook on the door and this little like twiny kind of stuff matches. Like we have like a little rug and I just thought it'd be cute to like put something there for the inside. So I'll rip that tag off eventually and like center it a little bit better, but lava. We'll start with some ornaments. So again, the vibe is just like neutral, cozy, homey. Um, so I got one of these little ornament sets, the little trees, um, but they're like ceramic-y. So I just thought they were so cute. I was like, how do I hang these? But there's little things to hang them from. I also got these little wooden ones, kind of like a tri, not tri-color, like dual color wood. And then it is like, I mean, I understand. Christmas is supposed to be like green and red and whatever, and I'm boring. But it's so hard to find brown ornaments. And if you do, they're like so expensive. So I was gonna order some on um, Amazon, but it was like gonna be like $50 for like 24 ornaments, which is just outrageous. So I ended up finding these at Target. I really kind of just wanted like the matte looking dark brown. But I mean, maybe these will be good. They kind of like pull a bunch of the colors we have in the living room. I don't know, we'll see. I have seen these little houses. I don't remember where I saw them. I don't know if Rachel had them in her vlog or if I saw them. Maybe I just saw them at Target myself. I don't know, but like I thought they're so cute. They light up, um, they're like battery operated. I was hoping, I think they have like three or four of them. I might go to a different Target and see if I can find like the third one. Um, Cause I kind of think they'd be cute on like, I don't know, like maybe like the windowsill in our kitchen or something. So it might be cute to have like 
three little different ones. We'll see. Also just thought this little tree was cute. It could be good for like the mantle or in the kitchen or something. Even the bathroom actually might match. Well, I don't know if it matches the tone in our new bathroom, but we'll see. I got us new stockings, which I will go run and grab so I can show you guys um, at Target. It's Hearth and Hand with Magnolia. That's the name of their brand. And I, oh, they kind of got scratched up being in here. I just wanted like a really minimal stocking holder to put on the mantle because I'm probably gonna put other decorations. So like having a big bulky like holder just isn't like really what I'm looking for. So these are like kind of expensive, but like I kind of feel like all of them are. They're like really heavy weight. So I mean, I guess, you know, kind of nice, but. I also got this little tree just because I thought it was so cute and like thought I could put it with some of the other trees. Just so there's like, they're all different kind of like textures and colors and stuff, like all different neutrals. I don't know, maybe to go in the bathroom. I thought this pillow was so cute. It has like a linen back. And then I love that the front looks kind of like crocheted. I just think it's so stinking cute and still kind of like a neutral vibe. So it matches just like really well. Hip, you are so beautiful. Oh my God. So these are the stockings I got us. I was so obsessed with them when I saw them. I'm like, I can't even wait because they're gonna be gone. And sure enough, I think I saw like one there today. They're just so stinking cute. These are also by um, Hearth and Hand with Magnolia. I just think they're gonna look so cute and cozy hanging up here. I'm thinking I'm gonna hang like two together over here and maybe two together on the other end. So we love that. Um, I also, this is from like a little while ago. I have these pillows all around the house. Like we have some in the bedroom, we have some on the couches. Um, they just had this one green one on clearance. Um, and so I got it. I don't know if it's gonna go in the bedroom or if it'll go here. We'll see, but there we go. I honestly might put up the stockings like now because I'm so obsessed with them. And this is Pippa's Christmas sweater, spoiler. It's so stinking cute. And I also got these on another trip. They're just like little coasters. I'm a sucker for a cute coaster. And they're little trees. They're like half wood, half marble. Okay, and the last thing I'll show you, my mom ended up going to um, HomeSense. No, at home. And she got a bunch of ornaments, but then my dad didn't end up liking them. So she was like, if you want any of them before I bring them back, like, let me know. So I thought these were really kind of cute. They are like little pine cone-ish things with little berries on them. And I thought it might be cute to add a little pop of red in with this because we have the brown and like these are sparkly. So actually I think they might match those other ornaments quite well. Yeah, I mean, they might match them well. So I thought about um, using these, so we'll see. Um, I'm gonna lay everything out together. They're not quite like the vibe that I initially had intended for, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna like hold on to them, but I thought they were pretty from HomeSense. No, at home. Yeah, and then I also have some of these from her as well. They're just like kind of like creamish um, snowflakes, which I feel like kind of match the vibe a little bit better. I don't know. The vision is, I'm having a hard time. That's it for my obnoxious haul. I am excited to decorate for Christmas. I have really, really loved the fall decor because I feel like it's made our space feel really cozy and homey. Um, but I feel like it's probably gonna stay year round. So we're just gonna try and tweak it to fit Christmas now. So, love that. So, we're gonna watch Love Island now. I'm gonna like maybe play around with where the stuff is going, but I'll update you. Hello, good morning, welcome back to the vlog you haven't left. Um, looking crazy this morning, but starting today's portion of the vlog out, it is Saturday and we are gonna do some cleaning and I'm gonna try and like start putting out some Christmas stuff that I got yesterday that I showed you guys and see like what I'm keeping, what I'm getting rid of, you know, that sort of thing. So I'm going to start with like cleaning just cause I wanna do like Maybe like a little transition video, like fall to Christmas decor, you know? So I'm gonna tidy everything up and then I can kind of like see where everything needs to go. So we're gonna start with tidying the living room and yeah, just ignore how bad my tan is. 
Okay, thank you. Up. So now I'm going to go ahead and just take all of the fall decor. This lighting is messed up. Take down all the fall decor um, so we could go ahead and start putting out the Christmas stuff. Let's do it. a bit later um, I decorated for a little bit I'm gonna show you guys again when it gets like light out tomorrow um, it's just like it's early, it gets dark so early that I hate like I've been sleeping on the couch I hate starting filming in like one cent like one sort of lighting and then it's like pitch black in like two seconds so I'm gonna update you tomorrow um, I definitely am liking the vibe. I feel like it's much more minimal. It's kind of the vibe I want to go for. I really want to keep like the color tone of this room and everything and just like the tones throughout the house. Um, obviously, I still want it to be like happy and Christmas, but just like more true to my style and not necessarily like the basic Christmas style. So um, I am just sitting on the couch here. It's like 10 o'clock, but... I don't know, I feel weird right now. I can't tell if I just still have so much energy. I just feel like I'm like, nothing's like entertaining me. Like I was watching Love Island, but then I'm scrolling on my phone and then I'm like playing games on my phone and looking on Pinterest and like, I don't know. So I might just like take advantage of this energy that I'm having to try and get some editing done. Um, I have some content filmed for Fab Fit Fun that I filmed like a while ago and I never got a chance to like take a look at it. Um, so I kind of just want to like upload it, look at it, um, see if like, you know, it's going to be usable or if I'm going to need to refilm that. Because if that's the case, I might try and refilm that tomorrow. Yeah, so that's the update. I don't even want to manifest this, but I'm a little bit afraid I'm getting sick. My, some of my family was sick on Thanksgiving this year and I'm nervous, I'm getting sick, and I'm gonna cry if that's the case. So, um, praying that that's not the case. We got Olive Garden takeout for dinner. Evan went to the store to get stuff to make us soup, and then he forgot his wallet at home. And so we were like, we'll just order food, and you can just pick it up. 
So we ended up getting Olive Garden and I had like fettuccine Alfredo and then like their garlic or their like breadsticks. Anytime I have garlic, one, I had gluten and I get like geographic tongue and like garlic's also kind of like acidic and does it to my tongue as well. Um, but anytime I have garlic, I feel like my mouth and just kind of like my throat are just like angry for like until the next day. So I'm hoping that it's just that and I'm just like really psyching myself out. But yeah, so just wanted to update you guys and I'm just gonna be sitting here on the couch for a little bit and just taking a look at some content and then I'm gonna head to bed. So I will talk to you guys tomorrow.